Hi guys, welcome back to your own channel Technical Sahil. In this video, or you can say from this video, we are gonna build our own SMTP server. Instead of building our own SMTP server, we can also use some pre-built services and tools like MailChimp, GetResponse, etc. But to become a pro in the field of email marketing, it is a very important or you can say initial step to create your own SMTP because it will not enable any restrictions for you. You can send unlimited emails with the unlimited frequency according to your server specifications. Plus, it is very cost effective as compared to the other email marketing tools and services. And by the way, for almost six months, it is totally free for you because I am providing you three links in the description of this video from the respective platforms like DigitalOcean, Linode and Volter. If you sign up there through my links, you will get a $100 free credit for the 60 days on each platform. In this way, you can use a $40 to $50 server for 6 months without paying anything to anyone. So without wasting any further time, let's get started. So I have already logged in into my DigitalOcean account. So the first thing I have to do is create a droplet. I am going with the default operating system Ubuntu 20.04 droplet I am creating a $40 droplet you can also choose this $40 droplet it is fast and as I explained earlier you will get a hundred dollar free credit for two months so you can use this $40 droplet for two months for free of course and same thing for the other two platforms so in this way, the SMTP server for six months is free for you. So I'm going with the $40. Data center, I am choosing UK. Password, I need to create a strong password. So we are taking a help of this tool. Okay, so I am copying this password as well. Here I am renaming it. You can rename whatever you want. Now we are done with the configuration settings. Create droplet. So as you can see, our server has been provisioned. Now we need to launch Droplet console. So our console has been launched. Now we need to run few commands, app, update, apt upgrade, we need to press enter. Now we need to install virtual min. So we just need to copy the command. Uh, by the way, virtual min is a free and open source web host control panel. It's a kind of premium thing. Uh, they have also a pro features as well, which you have to pay for. But the features we need, it's totally free. So the same link I provide in the description of this video. You just need to visit the link and copy the command from here and run. Now we need to copy this command. 
paste and press enter. Press Y and enter. Now it will take some time. Till then, I am fast forwarding this video. So guys, as you can see, our webmin has been installed. Now we just need to copy this URL or we can say copy the IP from here. HTTPS. Make sure you type the HTTPS and the port number is 10,000. Proceed to unsafe. Username is root and the password is same. Now we need to set up our virtual min through this wizard. So just follow the instructions step by step. Click next. If you are having the same VPS like I choose $40 then you can yes this option otherwise if you have a lighter like a $5 droplet then you need to enable as low as the resources as you can. So I am going with the default. I am enabling this because I have enough RAM. I am enabling the spam assessing as well. Yes, we need MySQL server, but we don't need this PostgreSQL. So I am going with the default. This is our MySQL root password. Save it on a safe place or you can change it. I am selecting the medium because I think this is enough. Check here because we did not update the DNS record yet. So check here to skip check for resolvability and click on next. Click next. Only store hash passwords and click next. Click next. Right now we don't want to create a virtual server we will create it later so click next click on finish click recheck and refresh configuration
so guys we have successfully configured our webmin we proceed with the further steps in the upcoming videos so that's all for this video thanks for watching